congenital, diaphragmatic, hernia. Also known as, CDH, congenital diaphragmatic hernia leads to, herniation of abdominal contents into thoracic cavity, most common cause, that leads to CDH. The most common cause of CDH is the formation of, posterolateral defect in the diaphragm, during development of embryo, it occurs mostly, on the left side of diaphragm, ratio of, occurrence of posterolateral defect in the diaphragm, it occurs in about, 1 in 2200 neonates, normal physiology during development, normally during 6th week. The pleuroperitoneal membranes fuse with other three components, as discussed in previous video on, development of diaphragm. This fusion completely separates the pleural cavity from the peritoneal cavity. Pathophysiology of CDH during development. If these membranes don't fuse completely in the sixth week, with other components of primordial diaphragm, then, a defect will be formed in the diaphragm that will connect the peritoneal cavity with the pleural cavity. So, the pleuroperitoneal canals will remain open, even after fusion. What is foramen of, bokdalic, as shown in figure, this defect formed in the diaphragm is called, foramen of bokdalic, this defect occurs in the posterior lateral part of the diaphragm, on the left side, mostly, because, right pleuroperitoneal openings close earlier than the left, so there are less chances of defects on right side, if this defect occurs, then abdominal contents will enter through this defect into thoracic cavity, most commonly, intestines herniate into thoracic cavity, but, stomach and spleen can also herniate into thorax, why is CDH dangerous, it causes hypoplasia of lungs, that leads to mortality of patient, the herniated abdominal viscera, push the heart and lungs anteriorly, they compress the lungs, and leave little space for them to grow in the thorax. Lack of space causes reduction of growth of lungs leading to lungs hypoplasia. Early detection of CDH. Prenatal detection of CDH is done by ultrasound examination and MRI. These will show the presence of abdominal viscera in the thorax. About 50% cases of CDH can be detected prenatally. Treatment of CDH. Treatment for this defect is, repositioning or reduction of herniated contents, and, repair of the defect in diaphragm. Most lungs grow to their normal size after treatment. 